Based on important information of the Belgian Security and Intelligence Office, we opened a criminal investigation uh, and a terrorist uh, investigation. Based on that investigation, we arrested two people of a Belgian nationality, but of Iranian origin, uh, that wanted to commit a terrorist attack in Villepinte uh, near Paris. Uh, those people uh, wanted to commit a terrorist attack at a conference held by an organization uh, that opposes the Iranian government. Uh, those two people were arrested in uh, uh, Wolof Saint Pierre, and uh, during the search of their vehicle, we found 500 grams of TATP, which are the same explosives used in the terrorist attack in France, in Belgium, and other uh, countries. Um, those two people were arrested in Belgium, one man was arrested in France and another man was arrested in Germany and that man seems to be an uh, Iranian diplomat uh, attached to the Iranian embassy in uh, Vienna uh, in Austria. Uh, we arrested those people while they were trying to leave Belgium and then they were going to Paris. So I can think we can say we arrested them just in time. Uh, it's always dangerous. Eh? It's 500 grams, it's half a kilo of TATP, which is a very uh, unstable explosive. Uh, most of the time it's homemade. Uh, that's why the anti-explosion service of uh, the Belgian army uh, had the, uh, the device exploded uh, uh, outside because it was too dangerous uh, to take away. When you surround those 500 uh, grams of ATP with metal objects, as was the case, for example, at the terrorist attacks in Zavotem and Malbeek, then you can do a lot of damage. Uh, I can't go into details, but uh, I must stress that it's an international uh, investigation, of course, as we arrested uh, or had somebody arrested in France and in Germany. They will have to ask the French authorities. I heard also that uh, Giuliano was present. All I can say that they were uh, planning a terrorist attack at the conference. I don't know if they uh, were targeting uh, somebody uh, special. We are now, I believe, and maybe it's even worse. We've seen some of that in the Middle East with each.